Hey everybody and welcome to part 8 of Yoshi's Island DS. I'm Solar Warlock. Let's do 2-7. Now I might get a lot of text messages because my girlfriend really has nothing to do at work, so if I have to pause between stuff, then I'm sorry. So we've got Yoshi on stilts. Wait, coins, really? Who cares about coins? Also monkeys. And what baby do we need? It doesn't even tell me what baby I need yet. The fact that you go um, I can hit that from here, right? I'm pretty sure. Well, anyways, it looks like we're gonna need Donkey Kong. Yeah, it looks like we're gonna need Donkey Kong, so let's go get him. Let's go grab baby Donkey Kong. Nah, we don't need you, Peach. We need you, DK. Remember, he falls a lot faster, so don't expect him to... Be the fastest baby in the universe. Yo! We made it. And we didn't make it. Well, that's sweet. Oh, I got a text message right away. Alright, I'm just saying okay. Anyways, um, I don't think that vine or that. Okay, I didn't think that coin was anything, but... Look at these gators can be turned into, uh... Um, eggs. Oh god. This water has that big fish that can insta-kill you. By the way, this, this, uh, game does have a boss that is a fish. But, like, it literally just rips off a lot of, like, its predecessor. Which I get that it like takes a lot of um, stuff from it, but uh, this game also uses the graphics of uh, the the uh, motion control GBA game that Yoshi had instead of creating its own art style, which is really sad, honestly. I need to go up there, but I can also go down here. I'm pretty sure. Oh, I think whatever would be better would be up this way, right? Water honestly moves too fast, though. Oh, my comment just got a, a a heart from somebody, but I don't even remember what I commented on. I really don't. Wait, dude, what the heck is that? Like, the fact that Donkey Kong moves so much slower and heavier than the other characters. See what I mean? Like, that pushed me, and I literally jumped right after it. Man, this is an annoying part of the level, part of the game. But see, the game has a lot of this type of stuff. But see, now all of a sudden... There we go, we made it up here. I'm assuming this is where the goodies are. Or that, apparently. Actually, I could have just pounded that, but whatever. I don't actually know who it requires me to grab. Pretty sure either way it's Donkey Kong. Okay, eggs of awesome colors. Can you just grab that egg, please, Yoshi? Oh, wait a minute. How do I get that? And now we just need Peach. I have a feeling it's not worth anything other than the baby coin, but still. Or no, it's actually locked. Okay. Those are just eggs. Then where's the key? Wait, where the heck was the key? Oh no, I missed. Also, these guys are called um Neb. I forget what their name was. I just figured out their name too. 
So I have no idea what was in that locked up door up there and how you even get to it, but... Oh yeah, the bungee piranhas. You know what's funny about these enemies? Is that they, um... You're gonna, you're gonna see them here pretty soon. In a different sense. I kinda wish I had Baby Mario though, because he could run faster. Also, I need eggs, so let's go back this way. Uh, let's see, what's down here? It says to go down, but then... I didn't need that. I needed eggs! Eggs, game, eggs! Oh well, no eggs for me. But Baby Mario, I think, will be ideal for this because he can run. Oh, you can actually go through his vines. I thought the vines were pokey so you couldn't touch them, but whatever. Let's go this way. Finally, eggs. Jeez Louise, is it that hard to find eggs, man? Well, I had, kinda had to do that because of this other guy coming up here. Dude, no, don't go away. No, I don't want you. I'm gonna eat all of you. Also, it looks like I need donkey. Oh, <laughs> never mind. Doesn't really matter because he's right here. So that's good news. Also, what's on this pipe? <coughs> Apparently nothing. Excuse me. Oh god, what the heck was that? It's a giant stealth guy. Also, I thought I ate you. Oh yeah. Also, I just forgot that this is a legitimate thing in this. Dude, can you not? I just wanted that. Thank you. Hey guys, look! The key! The... Oh, that's the key for there, not the key... Wait, what? Why is there another area? Alright, weird. Fine with it, but weird. Also, don't need any of that. So, the background was shaking. That's clearly a rope. Oh, it's one that you actually gotta swing yourself. So just, you know, move the analog stick left to right over and over. And then eventually you'll gain enough momentum that you'll be able to jump high into the sky. There we go. Thank you. And some red coins. And a vamoose. Let's open up the door. Oh, we got the target break one. Okay. Six of them in 30 seconds, not bad. Okay. Alright, I gotta move a little. Okay. Weird, but sure. Alright, man. And, no. No. Well, that worked, but. Oh well, we failed. Not a big fan of the bonus anyway, though. So whatever. I'm cool with it, man. Well, there goes that shy guy. Also, all my eggs are falling down the pit. Hmm. <coughs> Excuse me, another midway ring. I'm kind of weird just to have that here, but I'm cool with that. Oh man, not you guys again. I love how, like, Donkey Kong's attack is so explosive, though. Alright, let's not knock him off the cliff this time there, uh, Donkey Kong. Or that happens. You kind of feel like you're supposed to be able to make that, so... Well, you're able to make that, it's just got to time it really good. Also, what the heck was that game? What the heck was that? Oh, 
There we go. It was like all of the levels red coins pretty much there, man. Also the lava. Oh yeah, what is this? Use the stilts. Okay, cool. Can I like jump off of them? Okay, you can jump off, but that's about it. Oh my god, you actually walk really slow. Well, this is fun. Also, surprisingly, nothing. Oh, apparently you can't actually shoot your eggs. Also, apparently I have fire, but I can't use it until I'm off the platform, okay? I hear weird. Now we're doing it on the top screen. Also, there's a little fireball down there. Also, now we get red eggs. Goodbye, dude. You poor piranha plant. You didn't stand a chance against the Yosh. Oh yeah, you know what? That's just the BS, man. But sure, you're dead now. Man, those fireballs are loud down there. You guys hear them like... Bruh, bruh, bruh. Hey, that's a long time down there, man. Now we're back outside, and... Oh, you know what? These fish gotta die. There we go, the fish... The fish. Okay, you still swallow them whole in this. Wait, what? Oh, man, we missed two red coins back somewhere. Oh, probably up in that locked door, right? I'm pretty sure that's where it'd be. And no bonus, sadly. But we're gonna have like 98%. Yep, we got 98%, man. Which gave us nothing. Yeah, remember those piranha plants that I said? Guess what? They're the boss. This world literally has no theme. Big bungee piranha's lair. Also, this is some really uh, good castle music, bro. Do, 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 do. So much castle music. I am going insane. Well, looks like we're going under the water. Let's a dive. Now we got the same music that was in the volcano part of that level. Also, this gimmick, but now without spikes. Also, I need a baby who can bounce eggs. Or not really. Apparently, I don't need it. I feel like this game does too much with adding all the uh, coins in like the same areas. So first way, I want to get the uh, coins under here. I need to do this. And I just gotta hit the green one the other way. Oh my god, that waiting water sound though. Oh my god. God, being Donkey Kong in there is just awful. I kind of want to be Mario for this. Anyways, let's continue on. Okay, what baby can we be? Yo, oh, what baby can we be? Yo, oh, what baby do we need? Oh, what baby do we need? At this rate, I'm just thinking Mario. Just because Mario's faster, you know? Hmm. I feel like I'm going to need to push this again, so it's like that. I know we need to go down to actually progress, but, oh, wait, what? Oh, never mind, there's a pathway. Ah, uh, these are crabbles, by the way. Thanks for all the stars. Oh, God, I thought I took damage there for a second, but I didn't. I assume there's going to be, what, three? Yep, three. Not a bad coin haul. Uh, that looks also like the way we're supposed to go. Oh, wait, we need to turn the red. And there we go, this allows us to go down, and we got these guys again. Where the heck do I turn the red? Oh, wait a minute, no, I know what red it is. Also, when did we get introduced to Lakitu before Lakitu? Like, had his own level, you know? Oh yeah, some water, and with this we can now get that flower. And 
now what we have to do is we have to go back this way and hit this red because it turns all of them in the area into that so now we gotta go back up here I almost forgot and with that we are then able to continue over here and get this flower with the evil flower I forget what they're called I literally had looked up all the enemy names because I was looking at the uh, bowls they're called D bowls and there's like Fleepy, but they don't fall. You can find a picture of them for the thumbnails. Dude, no, you're not gonna hit me. I love their sound effect in this game, though. Hmm. You guys can't hurt me. You guys can't shoot through walls. Oh, you actually gotta hit this one with an egg. Or not. You can't actually hit it with an egg. It doesn't really do anything. Boom. Anyways, let's continue on. Is our midway ring going to be outside for some reason? Hmm. Waiting shy, guys. It's, it's adorable. Oh, I had to get under these. I believe you just ground pound. Yep, yeah, see? Though, getting out of the water in this game is not as easy. I don't know why they made it more difficult, but let's try and go down some of these pipes. Nothing, I don't think. Ah, uh, looks like we're gonna need this platform. Oh, hey there, Mr. Evil Dude. Hmm. Oh, wait a minute. I was supposed to take that, really? Well, that's BS. So one of my other things got a comment weird. Wait, wait. If you can spawn enemies there. Oh, that is bull, man. You guys see that for a second? Can I, like, go off screen? No, I'm screwed. Darn it. Wait, but I can't get back up there. Like, guys, I can't get back up there. Oh, wait, I have to go this way. Do we? I just can't get there. I was supposed to let the block push me under the water bef without drowning, you know? Anyways, we're not gonna get 100%, sadly. But this Chomp Rock, this Chomp Rock actually has an important factor throughout the, the boss fight. Not this specific one, but the gimmick. egg thing. Oh, this guy. So to defeat him, you gotta feed him eggs. And he's gotta keep eating until he gets big and explodes. So you're kinda, you're kinda feeding an overweight enemy. I don't see how that's very uh, kid friendly, but oh, he's dead. Poor guy got too fat and died. Anyways, thanks for the eggs and let's go. There's gotta be a checkpoint soon, there it is. It just sucks because most of the pipes are one way, so it's like, you can't go back. <sighs> Darn it, Crabble! Oh no, another Crabble. Well, there goes all my eggs. Let's run. But luckily, there's an egg block right here. They do give you egg blocks a lot more commonly in this game than they did in the original. I'm gonna say that now. Whoa. Hey there, pea pant. Pea pant. Pea plant bonanza zanza. Whoa, that almost got me. Uh, nothing really interesting here, though. Ah, looks like we got a piranha plant and a bungee plant. Which can be killed as easily as the piranha plants. Oh, we got... We got these guys, eh? Oh, yeah, dude. Can I have, like, your garbage, please? Yo, dude. Stop. 
Come on, give me your give me your stuff again. Do no! You suck so bad at this. Yo, dude, no. Well, he's dead now. Let's leave him to his shenanigans. Anyways, let's continue on. I'll go back and grab some more eggs. Because I really have a feeling we're going to need these eggs. Especially in this level. Now, with our six eggs in tow, let's do this. Oh. Hey there, buddy. That's a, that's a dick move, man. That was a big dick move, man. No, my eggs! They're not allowed to disappear. Also, why do I need to change babies again? Is there, like, a specific baby coming up soon? Oh, hey, Crabble. Again. Hmm. I need more eggs. There's a Crabble in the way. Oh, egg. Don't go in the water, buddy. Oh my god, he's on the freaking... to go. I don't think you can actually ricochet eggs in this game, which is really weird, but anyways, we get the baby Mario coin here. I feel like these levels are longer than uh, Yoshi's Island was, but at the same time, they're a little less fulfilling. I don't know. I don't know. Looks like we got the squirt fish. Okay. Oh, wait a minute. I th Yo, okay. Thanks, bro. Wait, why didn't you eat that one? I have no idea how I'm supposed to hit that. Oh, well, we got bit again. Well, sorry, Flower, but I have no idea how I'm going to get you. Anyways, I totally screwed this up with getting the, the freaking stars anyway. Look at my lovely flower. It's feeding time, and you're the main course, Yoshi. If I were you, I'd look for something else to feed it. Wait, why did you tell me how to beat it then? Because clearly there's a chomp rock. Like I said, would be an important factor in this. Yeah, I always think that this is the boss, and not the uh, one that's actually in um, this the first game. So now you gotta wait for a cursor. He only takes three hits to kill, but he is actually quite annoying. And with that, his tongue hurts. You gotta do that three times. And I believe he always does the whole wave of three little dudes and and that, but we don't need that many eggs, so let's we'll eat all his young right now. Just stand on it. Go ahead and bite it, bro. Poor guy. He's gonna have a, a toothache. He's gonna have a bad day, man. Oh, now he moves fast. Wow, he's so much more difficult being a fast-paced boss. <laughs> I really don't get bosses like this, though. They're not very difficult. Uh-oh. Darn it, man. You weren't supposed to actually eat me. Oh, yeah. Can I have my baby back, please? Thank you. Dude, you're not very nice. Darn it! He got me again! Dude! You are not a very friendly boss. He 
You know, I'm gonna just let them roll around. I don't really care about them anymore. There we go. We got the piranha plant. Now, I think he shrivels up. Yep, he does. That's probably one of our more worst levels that we've done. But, eh, 73 unlocked the scratch and match. Oh my god, even after a long episode, we have a cutscene. Yay. Dude, that's why you have the Stark. He's like, yay, baby Mario! The Stark is like, seriously, dude. Anyways, with that, we can now go to World 3. Now, World 3 starts off with what looks like a platform level. So, if you guys enjoyed this video, please remember to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys all next time for some more Yoshi's Island DS. Have a good day, guys. Bye bye.